Hello and welcome back to another episode of Dragon Age Origins where we still are in the Brazilian forest and let me just state for the record I love this place. I mean it kinda scared the crap out of me in the last episode when that tree came to life but regardless I really like this place because I love forests and yeah this is really everything that I love in a forest. It's beautiful, it's dangerous and full of ancient mysteries. I really like this place. I mean typically when I go hiking in a real forest I prefer the forest not to be dangerous but yeah. Anyway there's still a lot of forest to explore. Apparently we are pretty much done with this part I guess. So now let's uh, check out the east forest. Yeah, constitution increases a character's health and physical resistance. Thank you, game. Oh, look at that. Hala. Apparently there are wild Hala here in here. Okay. Lost the curse. Oh, this was one of the side quests. Yeah, right, the wife of that one elf. Oh. I thought I was prepared for this, but this still kind of scared me when it suddenly came alive. Let me go, let me go! Ugh. <laughs> Annoying roots. Okay. Oh, there are definitely some runes in here. Hmm. What is that? Forest barrier. Oh, this is a beautiful place. <laughs> I do not think we made any progress. We could barely see our way through the mist and now we are back at the beginning again. Okay. Find a way past the magical barrier in the forest. Huh. Yeah, I guess it will just repeat over and over. All right, so we have to yes, find a way. Yes, let's just keep going down the path. Whatever force is turning us around is bound <laughs> to get bored eventually, right? <laughs> it might. <laughs> but but I get the message, Severin. We should look for other op opportunities. Um, skeleton. Hello! Oh, two of them. Okay, let's do this a little bit more strategically. <laughs> Oh, there's a third one. Oh, boy. Um, I wonder if I can taunt the trees. <laughs> Let's taunt the trees. Yes, yes. Release me, release me. Okay, that tree is felled. Let's go for this one. And let's try to attack him from behind. Excellent. Okay. Mythal's blessing. <laughs> Mythal, the great protector. Okay. Um, sure, let's go and look at the Lost to the Curse quest. Is this a right way? Yes, this is the right way. Rabid werewolves. Yes. I actually wonder, I mean, we met some werewolves that could talk. So they were clearly intelligent. I don't know if this applies to all of them or just, just a few. 
Oh, and these definitely don't seem to be in a talkative mood. Um, hmm. Let's do threaten because I can't use taunt at the moment. Alright. Oh, there's another one. There's another one, but we're doing good health wise. <laughs> oh, that's her. Yeah, that's her, and she is a werewolf. I'm sorry. Um, yeah? Please. <laughs> Help. Listen. I am not the mindless beast I appear to be. And what happened to you? Well, that is kind of a stupid question because um, <laughs> it's pretty I obvious. Cursed, turned into this creature. A curse. It, <laughs> it burns in me. I fled into the forest. The werewolves, they took me in, but I had to return. I had to. You are human. I am. I was once an elf, one of the Danish folk. You know of my clan. Yeah. Your keeper, Thessrian, is the one who sent me here. The keeper sent you? Then you <laughs> seek Witherfang. I do. Have you seen him? <laughs> I have, but... <laughs> it is not what you think. Hmm. But <laughs> there is no time to explain. You must listen. My name is Denila. My husband. <laughs> he is called Athras. Please, you must bring him a message. The staff I wear. Bring it to him. <laughs> Tell him I love him. Tell him <laughs> I am dead and with the gods I beg you. Well... I guess I can do that, if you want to. Yeah, I spoke to Arthas. He worries about you. I want him to be at peace. He is a good man. Please do not let him suffer thinking of me. Oh, the pain. The curse is fire in my blood. Hmm. <laughs> it for me. Hand it quickly. Oh dear. Come on, there must be some way to heal you. Magic will not work against the curse. Ah, you must end it. <sighs> hmm. I need answers first, please, you must help me. I, I will tell you what I know. If you promise to end my pain. <sighs> well, if you sure that this is what you want, well, well, well I promise. Then, <laughs> Then do this. The werewolves are no longer violent animals. They have overcome the curse like I have. There is a ruin in the center of the forest. Hmm. You may find them there. They will think... You mean to kill them? 
I can tell you no more. <laughs> the pain, it is too much. <laughs> Please fulfill your promise. Ah. Uh. Oh, this is difficult. I mean, I think she wouldn't be opposed to, you know, mercy killing in general. <laughs> but, I mean, we don't really know what happens to her next. I mean, the other werewolves are fine. They seem to be okay in a sense that they are not in pain. So, presumably once she overcame this pain, she would just be a normal werewolf. And maybe there is a way to turn them back, I don't know. Um, but, I mean, I promised. I promised her, so... So be it, I guess. Ouch. Gods. Bless you. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> and let's skin her, yes! Oh, it's so horrible. <laughs> um, actually, what does my quest say about this now? Give Denyla's scarf to her husband, Atheris. Okay, I will do this once I return to the camp, I guess. Um, wrong direction. Okay, this is a barrier, we can't do anything about that. Yeah, let's let's explore this path. And maybe let's have a quick save in between. Bet you I can it in two blows. <laughs> Hello! Black beer, great beer, and another black beer. I still have rally on and threaten and let's have a war cry. And the Great beer is the bigger threat, apparently. Um, yes, I try to attack from behind. If anything, I mean, if the bear turns around, then at least the other people can attack from behind. So, I guess it's a good idea. Uh, yeah, we do. Alright. Okay. Ah, this forest is dangerous. There's something about this place that makes my skin crawl. Hmm. Well, maybe it's the ogre that has been hiding here. Uh Okay, uh, let's let's take care of the ogre. Oh, actually, it's two ogres. Hmm. Yes, Zeran needs some help. Uh, who we'll win? Mm. Maybe you can try to get out of the way. I doubt it, but. Let's let's try this again. Okay. First one is dead. Oh, I hate that attack. Alright. <laughs> let's have another try at this. Yes! Oh, yes! Awesome! Awesome! Yep. And... Dead. <laughs> I love these animations. I think I only saw it once before, and it was actually Alistair doing the kill on the first ogre we encountered. So... Any more darkspawn? Hmm. Pile of bones. Oh. 
I'll get another on it. gravestone. The air seems unnaturally cold around this ancient tombstone. Runes of warding are carved into the surface. Um. <laughs> yeah, you know, I always have to try my luck with every ominous uh, thing we find, so let's disturb the wards, obviously. Uh, and it's a revenant. Of course, it's a revenant. <sighs> okay, um, let's do this. You guys can take care of the skeletons, and I will try my luck with this revenant. Okay. Oh. Let's do this. Um. Yeah. Go around. Actually, I want no. Well, you did short work on those skeletons. Good, good work. Um, how am I doing? Uh, better be safe than sorry. It's just a pity that rejuvenate takes so long to uh, cool down. Because I really would like to have something that refills my stamina. I mean, mages can take lyrium, but... The warriors are kind of screwed. Mm. Rock mastery. I want to try the stone aura. <laughs> well, it looks awesome. And yeah, we're almost there. We're almost there. Um, but. Shale needs a bit of healing. Alright. Revenant is dead. Now let's take care of the skeleton. I think that's enough. <laughs> I wonder if the heal actually works when he has stone aura enabled. Probably not. I actually didn't really look if it if it worked. Okay. All right. Juggernaut plate boots. Ooh, I like this. I mean, I like my blood dragon plate armor, but I'm sure my other warriors will appreciate that. I mean, Alistair has been wearing his temple armor for quite a t some time. I may have to I'll look for something it. better for him soon. Uh, Zephyrin. Yeah. At some point I really need to make a round trip with Liliana and collect all these boxes. Oh. Speaking of which... I wanted to make some more poultices. Yes, I already had the health poultice recipe, by the way, that, which is why I couldn't buy it. I already had it, and I realized that, I think, after I finished that particular recording. And I bought some distillation agents, so I should be able to make at least some of these. Nice. And apparently I cannot make them in camp, which is kind of inconvenient, because uh, I need to win in my active party. Um Okay. Let's not attempt. Severin? No. Oh, whoa. Uh, have you been here before? Or did I just miss you? Well, let's get rid of all this stuff. Hermit. Oh, is this the guy who stole the acorn? Oh dear, oh dear. Not a werewolf and not a spirit even. What other woods coming to? <laughs> Hold on, old man. I want to ask you a few things. Questions, questions, always questions. They say it was questions that made me mad. Will you do the same for you? Um, ask a question and you'll get a question, but give an answer and you'll receive the same. Oh, I do so love to trade. 
You want me to answer a question? Wouldn't I have to ask you a question first? <laughs> Isn't that a question? Would you know a question if it was asked? <laughs> Are you mocking me? I don't know. Are you mocking me? I'm running out of questions. Stop answering every question with a question. But those are the rules. A question for a question, an answer for an answer. Were you not listening? Be careful, Grey Warden. This is no ordinary man. He is a mage. Driven mad, perhaps, but still powerful. No fair bringing mages to a guessing <laughs> game. Will you play by the rules or not? Then would you like to ask me a question? I think it is your turn to ask, is it not? Hmm. All right. Do you have the Grand Oaks Acorn? Ah, suddenly it all becomes clear. You hear that talking tree there? It all makes sense now. As a matter of fact, yes. I do have that tree's acorn. I stole it, and it was easy. <laughs> Silly tree should have locked it up tighter. If you want it, you'll have to trade me for it. And nothing from that silly tree. No leaves or branches or anything. <laughs> but that's all I have to say about that. An answer for an answer. There you go. All right. Um... So, can we trade for that acorn, please? Do you want to ask me another question? May I? Oh, yes, I think I might. Now. What shall be the first? Oh, yes. What is your name? Well, that's easy enough. <laughs> you may call me Skadi. Uh -huh. So you claim. They sent you, didn't they? But you're too tricky, and you're trying to fool me. Well, I'm on to you, just so you know. Um, okay. But it is your turn to ask now. Ask. Ask away, I dare you. Yeah, do you have anything to trade? Let's see. I'll trade you an acorn, a helmet I found, or a book I finished reading years ago, provided you have something hmm. interesting in return. Yeah, I want to trade for the acorn. Oh, and what do you have <laughs> to trade for the acorn? Hmm... Uh, I found some things in the forest, apparently. Oh, yes. Many things are buried deep here. <laughs> Treasures. <laughs> How about this scarf? Hmm. This is a scarf I got from Denyla, because I would rather return that to her husband. How about the silver ring I found in the ruins? Hmm. Sure, why not give him a silver ring? Hey, I once had a ring like that. This one's shiny still. Yes, I'll take it. Give me that. There. Now that's done. What else have you got on your agenda, hmm? Hmm. Do you want me... Do you want to ask me another question? May I? Oh, yes, I think I might. Hmm. Where were you born? <laughs> I was born in the town of Hyera, far to the east. Hmm. So you say, fiendishly clever of you to maintain this facade for <laughs> so long, but I will see through it yet. Mark my words. But it is your turn to ask now. Ask. Ask away, I dare you. Yeah, let's ask him again if he has anything for trade. Oh, yes. Yes. I still have that old helmet and the book. Mm hmm. Hmm. I want to trade for the helmet. And what do you have to trade for the helmet? Um, how about this book on elven history? I don't quite remember what this is. Uh, let's try to trade it. Elven history, you say? Hmm, that might make for good reading by the moonlight. Or it'll be better than using leaves. Give me that. There. Now that's done. What else have <laughs> you got on your agenda, hmm? Uh, May I? Oh, yes, I think I might. Have him ask another question. Do you have a knowledge of the arcane arts? 
No, of course not. I mean, I guess he is means if I'm a mage. So no. <laughs> oh well, that's disappointing. But wait, what if you are lying? Ah, you thought to scamper away without suspicion, did you? Well, mm. I'm on to you. But it is your turn to ask now. Ask, ask away. I dare you. I don't think I have anything left to trade. I still Do have I? the book. It's not missing too many pages. And Let's what do you this. have to trade for the book? Well, yeah, I don't want to give away the scarf. How about some gold coin? Coin? <laughs> what possible use could yeah. I have with coin? Do you see a money changer about? Yeah, I've changed my mind. I'm not interested. <laughs> well, that's your business then, isn't it? I still answered your question, and now it's my turn again. May yeah, let's I? have um, another oh, question. Oh, yes, I think I might. What is your relationship with your father? <laughs> what? <laughs> um, my father is dead. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Most interesting. So that means that you did indeed have a father. <laughs> ah, I knew I would trip you up sooner or later. <laughs> but it is your turn to ask now. Ask. Ask away, I dare you. So you live in this stump? Yes, I live here, and it's not as bad as you think. Where else to go, eh? I must stay away from them. They are out there and looking. They will take your secrets, oh yes, all of them, and leave you empty. But that's all I have to say about that. An answer for an answer. There you go. Um... I think I should oh, go. I see. You're going to report to them now, are you? Yeah. Fine. Goodbye. Yeah, uh, good day to you too, sir. Tree stump. It appears someone has dug a hole beneath a stump, leading to a tiny and filthy cave of sorts. Obviously the hermit sleeps in here. <laughs> okay. There also appears to be a small cubby hole with within the body of the trunk itself. It is filled with mud, twigs and other debris. Hold on you. That's private property. That's an old man's home, that is. Keep out. Keep out. <laughs> yeah, okay, leave the tree stump alone. Well, you are quite mad. But I find the mage's treasure. You have recovered one of the items hidden in the forest by the Devinter mage. The others are still out there. Oh, well, this is because we touched the gravestone or something, right? Return the acorn to the Grand Oak. Yes, uh, we have the acorn. That's the most important thing. And I want to see if I actually got a helmet. I actually may have. It's probably this one. Ancient Elven Helm. Uh, that's not a bad helm. I already had this one. Thing is, I don't really have anyone... Uh, Wearing medium armor, I mean, uh, save for my barbarian helmet, because my warriors are all wearing heavy armor and my rogues are wearing light armor. Well, I have a look at them, the helm later. Okay, so this just leads me back. Alright, um, I guess we will return to the uh, Elder Oak. Elder Tree it was, or... What was his name? Grand Oak, okay. <laughs> Let's return to the Grand Oak and return his acorn, I guess. And there we are, approaching the Grand Oak. And we have returned successfully with the acorn, so let's return My it. acorn is still gone. So I pray hm. to thee, hast thou any news for me? I do. Is this the acorn you seek? My joy soars to new heights indeed. I am <laughs> reunited with oh, I my love this guy. seed. As I promised, here it be. I hope its magic pleases thee. 
keep this branch of mine with thee, and pass yeah. throughout the forest free. I wish thee well, my mortal friend. Thou brought my sadness to an end. May the sunlight find you, thy days be long, thy winters kind, and thy roots hmm. be strong. Thank you. What a nice tree. And I leveled up, that's awesome. Because, yes, I can take another specialization. And as I already explained, I have chosen to become a berserker. Um, so let's see... I think I need more dexterity for some of my sword and shield skills, so let's take some of those. Uh, let's take a bit more willpower and show some constitution. And we will take the berserker specialization. Um, Berserk Resilience, Constraint, Final Blow. Okay. Yeah, I need at least 26 dexterity for the last uh, sh weapon and shield skill. And I need Master Combat Training, but I can only level up my uh, skills like every three level ups or something like that. I will have a closer look at the Berserker tree later. I definitely want to reach superiority. I mean I need level 16 but I am now level 14 so I guess I will take motivate now and 16 once I reach level 16 I will take superiority because this this sounds so awesome I want this. Okay um Woo! Elite! Yay! <laughs> I don't know what this means, but I am now elite. Anyway, I will end the episode here. And I guess now that I have the um, the branch, I can pass through the barrier and see what's behind. But I think before I'm going to go there, I will head to camp uh, quickly and exchange my team because, you know, I want to... Uh, Continue the quest with a different team and a different party and just have a little bit of diversity. So I will head back and pick a new team and then I will uh, yeah, continue with the quest in the next episode and we will see what's behind this barrier. So see you then.